In a quiet small town nestled between rolling hills and lush green fields, lived a boy named Max. Unlike most children his age, Max was fascinated by gadgets and technology. He loved reading about the latest inventions and dreamed of living in a city where technology was part of everyday life. However, in his small town, people still preferred to do things the old-fashioned way. There were no smartphones, no computers, and certainly no internet. One day, while exploring his grandfather's dusty attic, Max stumbled upon an old box. Inside the box, he found a small forgotten tablet. The screen was cracked and it was covered in dust, but it still turned on. Max wiped the screen clean and turned it on, revealing a world of apps and information. He was amazed at what he saw maps, books, games, and even videos. Max quickly showed his grandfather, who chuckled and said, That's an old tablet I used when I was younger. It's been sitting there for years. You can have it if you like. Excited, Max took the tablet and began exploring its features. He discovered that he could learn new things, play educational games, and even connect with people from all around the world. At school, Max's teacher announced a big project for the class. The students had to choose a topic, research it, and present their findings. Max immediately thought of using his tablet to help with the project. He chose to research the solar system, a topic that had always fascinated him. Using the tablet, Max found videos of astronauts, interactive models of planets, and detailed articles about space. He even used an app that allowed him to look at the stars and planets through augmented reality. Max's presentation was full of exciting facts and visuals, and his classmates were amazed. They had never seen anything like it before. After the presentation, Max's classmates couldn't stop talking about how cool and useful the tablet was. They all wanted to use technology to learn more about the world. Max had an idea. He would show the entire town how technology could be helpful. He planned a community event where he would demonstrate the tablet's capabilities. On the day of the event, the town hall was filled with curious people. Max showed them how the tablet could be used to read books, watch educational videos, connect with family and friends through video calls, and even control smart devices at home. The townspeople were fascinated. They realized that technology could make their lives easier and more enjoyable. After seeing the demonstration, the townspeople started to embrace technology. They bought smartphones, tablets, and computers. The school got a computer lab, and students started learning how to use the internet for research and projects. Farmers in the town used apps to check weather forecasts and manage their crops. The town even got a website where people could share news and events. Max was thrilled to see his town transform. Technology had brought new opportunities and ways to connect with the world. But Max also reminded everyone that while technology is powerful, it should be used wisely and not replace real-life interactions and experiences. Max became known as the town's tech expert. He helped his neighbors set up their devices and taught them how to use them effectively. He also organized workshops in the school to teach students about online safety and the importance of balancing screen time with outdoor activities.